everyone, so today I'm going to be showing you how to make wireworms for whitefish, perch, walleye, and pike. I tend to use them a lot for whitefish, but uh, the occasional pike comes in and I did happen to catch my personal best uh, through ice fishing. All right, so let's begin. So all you're going to need is just some wire. I have some red wire, some gray wire, and some black wire of different gauges. I also have some copper wire. You can also add some different colored beads to your wireworms uh, just to make it more interesting. I have some different colors here as you can see. Alright, so after you've collected all your materials, you're going to need a fly fishing vise. If you don't have one, um, you can still make your wire worms, but this fly tying vise actually does help a lot since it holds your hook in place and you have both hands to work with. The hook I'm going to be using is a size 6 streamer hook. So you're going to want about 7 inches of wire, depending on the size of the wire and the hook. We're going to start at the bend and we're going to move along the shank. Make sure you tie it as close as possible, one to another. You can always try and make the gap smaller with just pliers, kind of just squeezing it. And there you have it, you have a red wireworm. All you need to do now is just cut off the ends. 